Welcome to my channel. I believe I'm going to call it something simple along the lines of secondary level maths. But I'm not sure yet, that might change. Given that you're in the future compared to me, you might know something different. So you can probably see what the, <laughs> I hope you can see what the channel is called at the moment. I've planned to do something like this for a while now, but one thing led to another, I kept putting it off. Uh, with the COVID-19 pandemic though, which I'm currently in the middle of, or the start of, unfortunately, I figured it was a good time um, to do this. My goal for this channel is really twofold. My, f first of all, I would love the idea that maybe just a handful, one, even one of you, would get something out of this, would learn a bit of maths, or just feel more confidence to learn maths, to teach themselves maths with the help of some online thing. That's, that's my main goal. Secondary though, I'm still a bit selfish. I would love to get better at teaching. And that's what I really want for this. So I do recommend that you leave comments in my, in my videos. Tell me what I did good. Try to be nice. <laughs> Tell me what I did bad though. Like if there's some blatant mistakes, feel free to point them out. But even look for, like, look, I don't think you're explained this well. Um, I can't quite understand when you talk about this. This is going to be an iterative process. Now that's something we're going to learn in Matt's iteration um, towards the end of this series. But I can, because it's on YouTube, I can take a video down, well, more to the point, I can make a new video and replace the old one. And it shouldn't change anything else in this series. So that should be quite easy to do. So feel free to leave a comment that there is big mistakes or something. That will help me out a lot. With that in mind, as I said, we're at the start of this pandemic. So I am conscious that a lot of students are off school at the moment and a lot of parents have mentioned to me that they would love something like this. So I am rushing a little, which is never a great idea. So there, do expect some mistakes, mm -hmm. do expect uh, lower quality videos, but like I said, we can re-upload some of these if uh, any of them are too bad. And just over time, I'll probably want to re-upload them as I become better at teaching in this sort of format. So the series will be made up of multiple sections, um, and these will be the obvious ones like algebra, geometry, calculus, all these. Um, there'll be more than that. Uh, I haven't fully done out the syllabus now. But it's going to be fairly generic to secondary level syllabuses around the world. So I personally, at the moment, I teach in Ireland, uh, which we use the Leaving Cert. Um, so that everything in that will be in it. But I have also taught for three years in China where I taught the Cambridge International Syllabus, the Cambridge A-Level International Syllabus. Again, it's actually very similar. There, wasn't, there was just the odd difference here and there. Um, so no matter where you are in the world, I think this will be mostly appropriate. Please leave a comment saying something like, you know what, you've never done this part. This is in my course. It might be just a case that I've never seen it in the two um, secondary level courses I teach. But I most likely am able to teach it, so I will add it in. I'll personally be adding some things in myself that I, t I feel would be appropriate that isn't in the Irish system or the A-level system. So leave a comment like that and I can certainly add that in. Now each video will be probably between 5, 10, maybe up to 20 minutes long. You're not expected to watch every single video in order. There's plenty of these that you will already know yourself, you can skip. Um, and with that in mind, each section will have its own playlist. So for example, algebra will be the first one I make. You go to the algebra playlist and that should have a list of videos that um, will have their titles. For example, simultaneous equations, quadratic equations, uh, quadratic equations part two, three, things like that. Or um, I guess I'll be more specific than that. Quadratic equations um, using, the, using the quadratic uh, formula, um, factorizing, um, Examples like that, okay? I have a few of the videos already made up, but uh, I still to edit them and title them and things like that. But it should be, that's how I would expect you to, to watch this series. Go to the playlist, find the section you want, find the video you want, and start there. Do not watch every single video. With that in mind, while you're watching YouTube videos or videos online, basically, I've personally um, learned a lot um, on online video tutorials whether it be for computer science or even maths itself. They are incredibly uh, good to use. 
two things that I would like to point out to students that might not be used to uh, learning in this format. You are in control. You have a pause button, a fast forward button. Even in YouTube, I believe you can slow down the speed or speed up the speed of I'm how I'm talking. You can go faster or slower as you please. So but the main thing I recommend is pausing. So in a lot of videos, I would do a few examples. I certainly recommend pausing before I try them. Try them yourself. I recommend if at some point in the video you become lost, you say, wait, why did he do that? Pause it. Think about it. Try do the question again. Try a different example, something similar. See if you can figure it out. A 10 minute video might take an hour. That is fine. That is, you're not failing, you are learning. In fact, every 10 minute video probably will take you an hour or two because I will only be showing you the ideas. I will expect you to do the extra hour of work of practice. And that is getting a list of 10, 20, 30 questions from your book, from online. Going forward, I'll hopefully in each video in the description, I might be able to link to some open source uh, list of questions. This will be an ongoing process though, so please forgive me. So this control you have over the video, pausing and fast forwarding, it's incredibly powerful. Please use it. I also teach maths grinds here in Ireland. Now a maths grind is just a one-on-one -on -one mathematics tutorial, tuition. So I usually go to a person's house and I sit with them for an hour, teach them some of the same topics I teach in these videos, but I can talk to them, I can ask them questions, I can gauge how well they're learning and uh, work with them like that, in a, like a classroom but a one-on-one -on -one situation. I'm sure you're all familiar with the idea. Now because of the virus, because of the pandemic, I have been forced to stay at home. So I've tried to do a couple of these, just like we're doing right now, except my camera is flipped over so um, I can actually see them. So I'm FaceTiming them basically. I'm using a video, um, video call system and I can still interact with them. I was amazed how well, I was skeptical that it would work well, but I was amazed that it worked quite well indeed. I can still uh, teach them, I can still show them what I do on the board, and then I can ask them to attempt some questions to hold up uh, their attempts to the screen. I can see what they've done, I can see what mistakes they've done. They can ask questions. It works very well. If you would be interested in something like that, uh, please leave me a message. I, I, I think I can fit in maybe a few more students. Um, but please leave a message um, and I'll get back to you and talk to you about details about that. Okay, thank you for watching this introduction. The next video, if you don't go into any playlist, will probably be an introduction to the algebra section and then it will go into each video. If you've liked this, um, well honestly this is just an introduction. I was going to ask you to like and subscribe and all that, but maybe watch a few of the actual content videos first. Um, thanks for watching and have a good day.